Hmm. Oh boy. Alright. Let's pick up these bottles of something. Whatever this is, this Jack Daniels impersonator. Oh, fucking eggnog bottles everywhere. Oh. Oh, I was getting a bit dizzy there for a second. I don't know. I don't normally get affected by the job like this, but... Oh, I was getting really dizzy. I don't really want to look at these letters, but... I mean, I have to dispose of them anyway. Who... How would they be any wiser if I read a few of them before? Oh, Jesus, Santa. Shit, making a fucking mess. Oh, fuck. What is this? I don't even know what this is. Oh. Let's uh, throw this over here on this stool. Fucking, I don't know. Oh boy. Man. And a shitload of TNT. Rook's Keep? What in the world is that? Well, I guess some game company that Santa was a fan of. Oh, what do we got here? Dear Santa, I want a new Playbox 180 and a new iPhone 7325 and the new Racer Man car driver game. I also want a new bike because the one I got last year is dirty and I want a new Windbreaker air rifle too. I've been good, so I want these. Billy Sploid. Spoil. Oh, Billy Spoiled. Huh. Ironic. Not really, but a joke. Huh. Santa Claus, it is my birthday Friday. It, oh, it was my birthday Friday. Mommy got me only 23 presents and a soccer field cake. I hate her. I said you were better. I want 23 steak pies, 12 ice creams, 18 trays of reindeer chocolates, Three big boxes of fudge, a pair, five computer, with conscription, conscription three, black ops, brown ops, and a nitro genie go-kart. Signed, Stevie Chubbs. I'm sorry, kid, but there's a reason why you're Chubbs. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Oh my god, this one wrote a fucking novel. Dear Santa Claus, spelled Claus wrong, Happy Christmas. This year I want the new Arcanid, Arcanid Boy comic, a new motorbike, a killer falcon like the one Uncle Gunter has, a new stereo to make the butler mad, and a big tin of chocolate caviars. But the red ones, not the shit purple ones you gave me last year. Blech! I've been very good and only kicked people at, at school this year, and the butler and that man at the something. But that was one, that was a one, only one time exception. The clown is my birthday party fair. Timothy Crowley. Okay, well, Timothy, you also sound like a little shit. I mean, reading all these Santa letters make me a little bit afraid. Oh, what the shit is going on here? Dear brother, I am in jail again and need bail money. I was caught whipping children in the streets. In this one town, they're always trouble. I know you told me not to go out at Christmas, but why must you have all the fun? I'm so bored. I hope you send an elf with the money soon. I do like elves. So fragile. Remember, you owe me one for that, for that Russian mafia incident. Your brother, Krampus. Oh, what the hell? Is, is there something deeper to this? Is there something more to this that... Not told? Mr. Claus, Yuletide greetings, Mr. Claus. I represent a select group of people with great gift-giving ambitions. The Ku Klux Claus are looking for more people with your pronom pro prominence. Join us and we can show you great things. Lead you to greater profits, assist you in labor management, or grant you access to specialized equipment. We await your response. In snow and giving, anointed spring and clean, KKK. Okay, Santa, were you into some some fucked up shit? I certainly hope not. It's getting worse and worse. Uh, 
Uh, we got this. Dear Mr. S. Claus, invoice December 5th. Your total for this month comes to toys and other play items $953,050. Electronic devices $5,430,870. Shipping and handling $35,000. Total $6,418,920. Payment will be required no later than the 4th of the following month. Good day and thank you for your business. Wang Chow Industries. Oh, what the shit, Santa? So Santa can't make this electronic stuff. Okay, I need a new crate. This is... This one's getting bad. Alright, let's go and take care of this. Alright, let's get a new crate. Shit, Santa, what were you into? Buying your own freaking toys? been under the impression that you make everything, but this shit is getting more sophisticated every goddamn day. You're only human, apparently. You have bills to pay and shit. I'm just sorry. Take care of these knives. Get these in here. And, oh, man. Like, shit, what happened? This is ridiculous. Okay, we're good, 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 good. Oh, no, 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 no. What kind of knives are these anyway? Where the fuck did Santa get these? All right, let's get these shells. We're good, get this shit cleaned up and then mopped up. And then we should be good. Get this knife out of the fucking doll. Santa, you sick fuck. Don't tell me you were into voodoo as well. Like, I really don't know what to do with this TNT. But shit, look at it. You're fucking crazy. Uh, you. Up on the shelf. That's where you can go. I'll check out some more of these letters here from Santa. Or some of these letters for Santa. See what the hell these are about. Some of them were urgent and final notice. Don't tell me he was getting his place was getting foreclosed. If Santa's place was getting foreclosed because he couldn't afford all of these things. Oh wait, is this a Molotov cocktail? Oh shit! I don't. I don't actually know what to do with that. Uh, let's take this. No. Let's take this one in the back. Read this. Dear Sir, find and close your invoice and receipt for the following items Five crates of tri nitrolene. Tri nitrolene? Two boxes of the select heavy edge knives and eight boxes of 12 gauge shotgun shells. Pleasure doing business with you, sir, and don't forget about our. Loot em and shoot em sale. All items 25% off and more until the first. Shooters and looters, fine munitions since 2001. Okay. They should have noticed this. Alright. Dear Mr. Claus, I have in my possession video footage recorded in infrared of you along with your gang entering one of my premises via the fireplace. The footage also shows littering and you personally removing my valuable property, milk, glass, and confectionery items. At present, I am preparing to forward this evidence to local authorities unless I receive compensation from your organization in the sum of no less than $100,000. I have generously decided to give until Monday to complete this transaction or face the consequences of your transgression. Yours faithfully, Lord Devian Snakely. Shit, he was getting blackmailed? What the fuck? Urgent, it is with, it is with heavy heart and dwindling pocket that we regret to inform you that you are being sued in the amount of $250,000. 
The claims are as follows. Destruction of property, damages, emotional suffering, public disturbance, and obscenity. Apparently your reindeer had defecated across a house or something. I need to, I want to read this. Your reindeer had defecated across a house or houses as they passed by the area. For full claims and details, please read thoroughly pages 5 through 49. I'm burning this evidence. I don't want people to know that Santa was in this bad stuff. Alright. Mr. Claus, it is with great regret that I find myself forced to write this correspondence once more. As our investigation determined, the atrocious conditions which you force upon your elves, elven brethren, must cease immediately. The low pay, the incredibly long work days, the lack of holidays, it's inhuman. If we at the Union do not see radical changes in the next three weeks, we will be forced to pursue legal channels. And then, sir, you shall see that you shall see the fury of the elves is not so small. Good day. Tiny Littleton, Secretary General. Jesus Christ. Santa was really getting face getting a lot of shit thrown at him. Holy shit. No wonder he fucking lost it. Everything was falling apart for him. He was getting sued. He was going bankrupt. He was fucking... The elves were starting to unionize. Which, I mean, I didn't think they even cared about. This is messed up. Oh, well. I gotta do my job here. No matter how I feel about the situation, I have a job to do. Just as he had a job to do. And for some reason, he didn't want to do it. Well, I, fuck, I can't say there's, for some reason, he didn't want to do it. There's a clear reason why he didn't want to do it. I feel bad for the guy now. He's been doing this for how many years? It's a thankless job. That's all that this is. You don't get any thanks for doing this. He was doing this out of the goodness of his fucking heart, and all of these people turned on him. I'm just cleaning in general, just making sure everything looks good. Now I really don't know what the shit to do with these Molotovs. I mean... Oh! This is a shot... This was a shotgun he used. Okay, we're just gonna go ahead. They don't check my bin. Alright. They don't check my bin when I leave. It's all my personal property. So let's just put that in there. And close that up. Okay, let's uh, just pretend we did not see that. Get the sniffer to... I don't know how this thing works. They gave me this machine and just said, okay, here, this is some new test equipment we got, but... I don't know how the frick to use it. Alright, so, Molotovs. So what happens if I just put this in the fire? predicament now um, I'm gonna take these and I'm gonna put them in this water that's what I'm going to do and then I'm gonna burn them quiet phone I'll deal with you later <laughs> 